Hello again. Today we're going to work with Spell Time 6, page 4. And the story is called Everything But The Kitchen Sink. Jack and Jill were going away for the weekend. As usual, Jack packed almost nothing. He just packed a small bag. Jill packed three suitcases. She packed enough for a six-week holiday. Jack was not happy. He said to Jill, The only thing you did not pack is the washing machine. The taxi was late, but the plane was even later. All the planes were delayed because of bad weather. The airport was very crowded. They had to wait for five hours at the airport before they could check their luggage. Finally, Jack put the three suitcases on the scale. He opened his small bag where he kept their passports. Why didn't you pack the washing machine? He asked Jill. The washing machine? Answered Jill. Why? Because our tickets and our passports are on the top of the washing machine. Answered Jack. Did you enjoy it? Okay, let's look at the story again. And this time we'll talk about one or two words. Jack and Jill were going away for the weekend. You remember there are two people, so you say Jack and Jill were going away. If there was only one, you'd say I was going away or he was going away. As usual, Jack packed almost nothing. Packed. You hear the t sound? The ed is pronounced t. Later on in the story, we have another ed sound. He opened his small bag. You hear? Opened. So it's not t, it's d. But you don't have to worry about it because it comes almost automatically to say packed, opened. It's one of those things that happens automatically. Let's have a look at washing machine. Washing, you see, is spelled S-H, wash. And machine is spelled C-H. So the S-H sound can, and the C-H sound both are pronounced sh, washing machine. Try and read the story for yourselves now. Well, my friends, that's all for this time. See you soon.